Dirty silver. Hey, welcome to Hardware Science. Here we are. We're shooting a signal through Cambridge, Mass. Yes, we are. Right here from Faraday Studio. And this is Al. Hello. And this is Anna over here. She's visiting tonight. And there's Otta. Get a picture of Otta. She's just sitting over there, just so laying next to Mama. Is that, was that, who's that behind you, Anna? My grandpa. Is that grandpa? Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh. He's a handsome dog. <laughs> Isn't he? And here we are at Faraday Studio. We've got a small crowd tonight. We're going to do a little chemistry tonight, Al. All right. Okay. Great. I just want you to think about now Here's a penny, and it's pretty new. You've seen yeah. a shiny new penny, right? Oh, yes. Now here's an old penny. Good. Shiny new penny. Can you see that? It's kind of nice and shiny. Shiny new penny. And then looky here, Al. This old, dirty old penny. Ooh, corroded. Corroded, cheesed yep. out, isn't it? Yes, it is. It's kind of brown, dark. It's even got some green on it. Yep, and blue. Blue? Where yep. do you think that came from, that blue and that brown? Hmm. The so, brown stuff that came on the penny. Maybe some chemicals. Chemical? Yeah. yeah. Interacted with it. It's chemicals interacted yeah. with it. Here's a, here's a piece of steel, right? And, and look, it's got this, this uh, red stuff. Ooh, yeah. What do you call the red stuff that's on iron? What do you call that? Uh, Starts with an R. I'll give you a clue. Rust. rust. There you go, rust. There this man go. needs to get around more. <laughs> they call rust, right? Yes. Pennies turn brown and they'll even turn green because they're copper and iron, steel. And iron. Steel's got iron in it. And iron, when it, it can combining with something, changes colors. Do you know what rust is made of? Uh, no, I do not. Anybody? Rust. Anybody? Blake, what's rust made out of? Oxygen, 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 thing, yeah, oxygen, yeah. Iron, oxide. iron oxide, there we go, <laughs> iron, so I've got the iron here, where did the oxide come from, I don't get it, you see any oxygen around here, uh, the air, okay, the now air we're getting there, oxygen. see we're thinking like a yeah. side is, aren't we, that, yes we are, that's right, so for some reason, the iron in here combined with oxygen in the air, it's called oxidate, that's a chemical reaction, right, mm. so all of these metals that I have here have combined with oxygen, and here's the one that's that's kind of the saddest is a nice piece of silver. You know, you know what silver looks like when it's new, it's shiny, yeah, right? Yeah, shiny. Look yeah. At the, what's what's wrong with this? What's it look like? Mm. This is one of my grandmother's old yeah. serving forks, I guess. What happened to it? Uh, oxygen. Yeah. You know, it it combined it. with something. Yeah. And normally silver combines with some with oxygen, but also sulfur. Sulfur, yes. Sulfur in the air. Is that sulfur in the air? Sulfur in the air. A little bit. Yeah. It comes from usually from automobiles. You know. Stuff in the air when things are burned that have sulfur in them, you get some some sulfur compounds in the air. And so this on a on the silver spoon, or like on this cup here, the silver cup is starting to turn black. And that could be uh, silver sulfide or silver oxide. You know. Yep. Now how am I going to get with? I don't want to. I don't want to scrub this beautiful silver thing. How could I get the silver to let go of the oxygen? And sulfur. Well, what did I do at the dance? You let go. Of I let go, but why did I let go? Because you saw somebody uh, yeah. else. Yeah, somebody else that I liked a little better. Yeah. So all I have to do is to trick this oxygen who is dancing with the silver right now to say, hey, I like something better. That's all I have to do. That's all you and, have, to and do. have to do. And let go and go, I'll go over here. Well, there's one thing that. that that a lot of oxygen like is aluminum. Aluminum is well loved by oxygen. As a matter of fact, here's an aluminum bar. And you'll say, you don't see much rust on that, do you? No, nope, not much. Just a little dirt from my. Yep. Well, you say, well, aluminum doesn't rust. As a matter of fact, that's not true. Aluminum rusts so fast that the oxygen run to, runs to it so hard it just binds to it almost like that. Mm -hmm. And then that it blocks it from reacting anymore. So this, uh, if you ever take a piece of aluminum and would sh scratch it with a knife or something, it'll stay shiny for about a minute. Yeah. And then it turns back to this gray color because it oxidizes so fast. Aluminum just likes oxygen a lot. They get along well together. So you see in this water here, and this is what we're going to do at the hardware store. Well, at the hardware store, I got this pan, and I put some aluminum foil in the bottom of the pan. Okay. So there's the aluminum, and here's the spoon. And I'm going to try to get the, the, the dirty stuff off of the silver and go to the aluminum. 
You with me so far? I am. Yeah, because they'll go running. He's, he's just like I did to old Peggy. Bam, <laughs> run right over there. But I've got to give it away. So what we're going to do, we put, some, we put some aluminum in there. And in order to give the, the, uh, the solution the ability to conduct the ions from one thing to another, we're going to add a little baking soda. So just pour about a spoonful of baking soda in that. Just a little bit in there. There you go, a little bit more. Okay. And we'll stir that up. Okay, I'm gonna get that box open a little better for you. Yeah, get some, yeah, get some in there. And it, it, there's no set amount. Stir that a little bit with a stirring rod. Okay, and then I'm gonna pour in a little table salt, just a little salt. And what happens is the salt and baking soda. Uh, there we go. And you notice Al is wearing a uh, an apron. Uh, he looked very stylish, I must say. You yes. are with that school. Let okay, me have that baking soda. Oh, okay. I'll put just a little bit more in there. Usually you put in about a spoonful of baking soda and a spoonful of salt. Put that in there. There we go. And stir that around. And that puts some ions in the water to give a pathway for the exchange to take place. Now, are you ready, Big Al? I, I hope am. this works. I'll hold that. So with the camera. Let the camera see the dirty spoon. See how dirty that is? Very dirty, yes. Very dirty. Got that yep. black hole silver stuff on would you dip that in there i would love to yes in case we have an accident here with this and it blows up everybody <laughs> say goodbye al, goodbye, goodbye, al. al. <laughs> i stick it down in the water let's count to ten. One, two, three, four, five, <clears throat> six, seven. kind of move it around just a little bit a little bit there don't be shy how are we doing we get in oh al what's happening oh it's coming off it, it is seems, it's, it's yeah. not all the way done but just pulled no. out let's, let's see what it's done so far Ooh, look oh, at wow. that. Look at that. Show it to the camera. They did part, most of that came off, didn't it? It did. And just in a few seconds. It's very right? shiny. Yeah, yeah, and I'm going to have to get a bigger bowl if I want to lay that down. Let me try. Let me try. Oh, yeah. A lot of that. Let's put it back in there a little bit longer. Let's try this old dirty cup right here. See that, that bottom of that cup's kind of black? Yeah. Why don't you lower that down in there? Let's see what happens. Count to 10. Get a few seconds. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. You know what's happening right now? Uh, the sulfur and oxygen yeah. are saying, uh-uh, sorry, silver, we're out of here. <laughs> Aluminum's in town. <laughs> Let's pull it on out and see what happens. Sweet. Oh, wow. Look wow. at that. Isn't that amazing? Look at that. Little hardware science chemistry. Were, were you impressed, Anna? Yeah. So what do we do? Is we just do a little uh, salt and baking soda to, to, to charge up the water so that the exchange can take place. And the oxygen just left, and the sulfur just left that silver and ran over to the poor old aluminum. Hey, you're stuck with her. Sorry, <laughs> that's the way that is. All right, everybody say goodbye. <laughs> See you later.